Hi everyone, so the objectives of the video today are firstly to understand x-ray diffraction and then we're going to look at some formulas to determine the relationship between wavelength and the lattice parameter A. Okay, so firstly, what is diffraction? Well, diffraction occurs when a wave encounters a series of regular spaced obstacles. So the way that we're talking about in this case is x-ray waves and the regular space obstacles, well, that's just going to be the regular space obstacles are provided by the lattice parameter A evenly spaced out. So the crystalline lattice formations as we've been looking at in the previous videos. So the spacing of the obstacles has to be equal to the wavelength of the incoming wave. So let's just look at this diagram here of an incoming wave. So on the left hand side, these waves are incoming. And then on the right hand side, we have the outgoing waves. So the waves come in this way and then are reflected back at the same angle off of the regular spaced intervals. So this angle here and here are the same angle and they we call them the critical angle. So we're going to refer to that as theta with a subtext of C for critical. This D here, that's the interplanar spacing. Okay, so we're going to look at some formulas now, which are going to be able to link wavelength of a wave to the interplanar spacing, also the lattice parameter. Okay, let's have a look at that. 